Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hey, what's up? My name is Caitlin, and this is the channel where we talk all things toys and dolls. Today we're back with another Monster High doll unboxing. Today we're going to be looking at the fabulous Miss Caddy Noir. I am super excited for this doll. I finally found her at my local Walmart, which is still insane to me that I'm finally having Monster High dolls at my local Walmart, but I'm so excited. <laughs> so here she is in all her fierceness. She looks so good. She's got a bunch of accessories over here. Her little 13, her cat, whose name is Amulet, I believe, or is that the Amulet? I'm not sure. Okay, we'll have to figure that out. <laughs> and then down here, she has her cat, and then there's Claudine and Frankie with her on the back here. We have Caddy coming to Monster High, and then she has the like revamped signature dolls so there's Frankie, Claudine, Draculaura, and Laguna in their like second signature doll looks. Down here it says monster type pop star performer <laughs> pop star performer wear cat monster muff I can't talk monster must haves sheet music and lucky mirror monster pet is amulet so the pet is amulet which is good to know so yeah let's get into her and i will be right back and we are back so accessories first she has these bright blue um heart-shaped glasses that kind of have like a crack in them I'm trying to figure out if that's meant to be there yeah it probably is it's like broken mirror which is her thing then she has this little water bottle that kind of is carried like a lantern and it has the number 13 embossed on the side there if you can see that. I know my filming area is a little dark. I'm working on it, but this is the best I had for now, so I'm sorry. Um, then she has her shattered hand mirror that's in the shape of a heart with cat ears and it says 13 on the back. Super cute. Really love that. And then she has a phone that's in the shape of a coffin with cat ears. I'm trying to see what's on there. I can see a 13, what looks like a heart. That kind of looks like a witch. I'm not entirely sure. Um, and then the back of it looks like a shattered mirror again. And the number 13 really, really goes hard with that 13 because everything she has has it on there. And then this is music notes. I don't think those are real words. I was trying to see. But she's got shooting stars, search inside, and steal the show written in here, which is super fun. Call back to G1 with steal the show. Really great. I loved Boo York. That was one of my favorite Monster High movies. And she has a mirror. Nope. <laughs> this is a microphone that is also cracked. And then it says Caddy where she holds it, which is fun. She's got this a ginormous backpack that is also super cute. It's in the shape of a heart with cat ears and it kind of looks like a jewel. The back is chains. The only thing about this I don't like is when you open it. Like these two ginormous things are in here, which is just obnoxious and takes up a lot of space. But I think you can still fit most of her stuff in here. Mm, you can't fit the hand mirror in there very well, can you? Yeah, see, once you, those things are in the way, like, it's kind of impossible to get stuff in here, but... It's okay, I guess. Um, yeah. Okay, we're going to stop messing with that and just move it to the side. And then finally, we have her pet, which I'm so excited that Caddy gets a pet this time because she did not get one in G1. And that is Miss Amulet. I shouldn't say Miss. I don't know if it's a boy or girl, but <laughs> she's really cute. Again, uh, I love the little star on the eye with the eyeshadow and then this cute little pink fur thing. That she's the cat's wearing and then her tail does move a little bit as well but there it is amulet and now miss caddy noir <laughs> she's so pretty i feel like everyone was just super excited that we were finally getting a plus size doll and like a curvier doll that that's kind of everything they talked about nobody really talked about how good she is at least not that i've seen i haven't really watched a lot of reviews i tend to not watch reviews on dolls I haven't reviewed myself yet just because I don't want to sway myself but anyway <laughs> she's absolutely stunning I love the side glance her eyes are so beautiful with this like eerily pink 
look to them with that white in there and then her eyeshadow is cool it's like i don't even know how to describe it it's pink and white and silver but it's like a shadow of it which is crazy and then her eyebrows are kind of the same way barely there she's got stars and then her lips are kind of like popsicle lips where it's just in the center and then it fades out super pretty she's got some cat ears up here and then a cute little piercing on the left ear and then you guys already know i'm a sucker for a micro braid and she's got them i do have a few pieces that are messed up i'm trying to fix them a little bit I don't think it's too bad, but I wish it was all micro braids, <laughs> but this is still really, really pretty. Her hair is a little rough. Like you can see where the box kind of got a hold of it. So it is a little rough, but it's not the worst hair I've ever felt. I, just, I love micro braids. They're so pretty. See, like that. I want that, but like all over. <laughs> I still really like it though. And then... She's got this cute little heart-shaped necklace on that does, of course, say 13. I don't super love these ginormous sleeves, but they're not horrible. They do feel very plasticky. And then you can kind of see in the back as well how see-through and plastic it really is. Um, look at that. That's so cute. She looks so good. <laughs> the dress. I feel like a lot of people don't love the dress, but I think it's cute. It is strapless. She's got like these clear straps on it and then it does look like a mirror. It's got the 13 around this belt with a broken heart and some pink chains. And then this pink piece. Does this go all the way up? Let's see. I never take <laughs> my doll's clothes off, but I want to see if this is one piece or two. Oh gosh, this is going to be obnoxious, isn't it? Okay, the jacket comes off super easy. I just want to know if this pink is sewn. Yeah. Okay, the pink and the mirror dress are one piece. They are sewn together. But once you take off the like belt and the jacket, it does kind of look simple, which is weird because it's literally a shattered mirror. But I don't know. I definitely like it better with the accessories. And then her boots are very, very cute. They are this bright pink, and then they have the chain detailing, broken hearts, and buckles on the front. The bottoms kind of resemble like a broken mirror, in a sense. I'm going to put her accessories back on real quick. Um, I have seen a lot of restyles of Caddy where they do like the shattered glass, not shattered glass, shattered mirror boots, kind of similar to what G1 had. I will say I definitely, I definitely prefer that, but I do like these boots. They are cute. They just would have been better had they been silver and mirror-like, <laughs> but this caddy is really good. I don't, I don't know which one I prefer, G1 or G3. I need to do another G1 versus G3 round. We have been getting several more dolls now that more have come out but I think I did like 15 in the first round so I think we'll wait till we have about that more many more to do but yeah that's it for Caddy she's really really beautiful really cute I like her a lot she's fierce she's great anyway <laughs> let me know down below if you like G1 or G3 Caddy better all your thoughts and opinions all that fun stuff let me know don't forget to like this video before you go and subscribe so you don't miss out on any more of my future videos. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.